Hi guys, it's Cassidy, and I'm back with your Fit Friday video of the week. And this week's this week's workout is going to be a personalized workout. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to spell out our names, and we're going to do the workout that corresponds with our name. So if we want the if we have a short first name and we want to make it longer, we can use our first name and our last name, or we can just spell out our first name and repeat the workout one or two times. So if um, spelling is hard for us or we don't want to take the effort to uh, look up and personalize our workout, you guys can just do um, my workout with me. I'm going to spell out my name and go through those exercises. So those are your two or three options and we can get started. Oh, and I just wanted to discuss a couple modifications before we get started. Um, if any of those workouts are too hard for you, you can modify them or you can pick a different workout from the list. Um, for push-ups, you can either do wall push-ups, you can do knee push-ups or regular ones. For jump rope, you don't have to use a jump rope, you can just jump up and down. For tricep dips, um, you don't have to do them on the couch like the picture shows if that's too hard. You can always do the ones that we did in one of our other workouts where we sit and we bend out our arms like this. Those can also be your tricep dips that you do. And then those speed speed skaters are um, the workout that we did in our winter games themed workout where you're jumping back and forth and kicking your leg behind you. And again, um, if your name uh, corresponds with workouts that you can't do, you can go ahead and pick, let's say, 10 exercises from this list and go through 10 of those or pick five exercises and do the workout twice. Yeah, so let's get started with spelling out my name. Uh, like I said, you can do this workout if you don't want to spell out your own name. So the first letter of my name, my name's Cassidy again. So the first letter of my name is a K. So we are going to get started with, I'm finding my letter now. The first thing we have is 10 leg raises, okay? So what we do for those, so we lay down on the floor and we want to keep our back our whole back flat on the ground and it helps if you put your hands in your butt to um, keep your back on the ground. So for the leg raises you just lift them up and lower them down. So one, you try to squeeze your belly muscles too. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. And then the second letter of my name is an A. And for A, we have 15 jumping jacks. So I'm going to adjust my camera and we can do our jumping jacks. All right, ready? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. If I went too fast, I apologize. Uh, you can pause the video and finish out your jumping jacks. Okay, so the next two letters of my name are S and S. So we're going to do those together. So this might be a little hard because... We're combining two of them, but you can pause in between if you need to. So for this exercise, it's isometric, which means holding, like holding your position, and isometric squat punches. So it's 30 seconds for that exercise, but because I have two S's, we're going to do it for a minute, okay? All right, so I got my timer. Here we go. So you're just in your squat position, bent down, and you're punching, kind of like you're a boxer, but just with your legs bent. This one's gonna burn because it's two exercises in one, so we're holding it for a long time. Just do the best you can if you need to, kinda. You can stand up and punch if you need a break, but try to stay down like this the whole time. And we'll wait for our timer. You punch up, you punch to the side. Just try and stay in your squat and keep punching. You're doing great.
10 seconds left. Keep going. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good job. So the next letter in my name is an I. And for I, our exercise is um, shoulder press. So for these, I'm going to be standing up. Put your hands up like a field goal post in football. Um, and then we're going to put them by our shoulders. And we're just going to press up like this. So one. And we're doing ten. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Good job. So the next letter in my name is a D, and our D exercise is 10 good mornings. So those are, we're standing, we're going to keep our legs pretty much straight. You can have a little bend in your knees. Your hands go behind your head, and you're bending down like that. We're doing 10. So one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. We only have two letters left in my name. Uh, we have another I, which we just did. So we're going to do ten more shoulder presses, okay? So remember, we're here, and we're going to do ten of them. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. And the last letter in my name is an E. So for E, that's 30 seconds of nutcrackers, okay? So I'll get my timer started um, after I explain to you what we're going to do. But I'm going to get that ready first. So the nutcracker, we're standing here. You're basically going to put your hand out and try to kick your um, foot to it, like this. You don't have to go all the way high, I'm pretty flexible. You can just kick your foot up a little bit, like this, that's good. But we don't really want to try and kick high, so like this. Okay, and we're going to do that for 30 seconds. Last exercise. Good job, guys. Ten more seconds. And done. Good job, guys. I hope you guys liked this workout. It was a little bit different, but I wanted to change it up and make it more personalized. And hopefully you guys had fun working on your spelling. And even if you're good at spelling, I could always use work on spelling. <laughs> But I hope you guys had fun with this workout, and maybe we'll reuse it in the future. If you want to drop some feedback, if you like this workout, um, in the comments, that'd be great. Good job today, guys. See you next week.